Fox 10 News is back. We just wrapped up National Nurses Week at a time when the demand for nurses is high and morale we're hearing is low. And the medical field, long dominated by women, is looking for a few good men to fill its ranks. Anita Roman has more. Nine years ago, Hector Medina helped deliver his daughter in his living room, a life-changing event for a number of reasons. After that, I uh, you know, saw everybody at the hospital working on my daughter, and it just was motivating, and it was you know, captivating seeing them you know, work on her, putting her under the heat lamp. And I was like, wow, like, this is something that I think I could do. Medina joined the Navy shortly after, stayed in the service for six years, but his passion for nursing was still burning. So he went back to school. He's currently completing semester eight of nine. Interesting enough, 200 years ago, this was a male-dominant job. Um, so I, I feel like men think that they need to do things that are more masculine. Honestly, nursing is physically, emotionally, and mentally challenging, and I would recommend it to anyone. The more diverse the workforce is, the better. Um, males are about 12% right now of nursing nationwide, um, and we're in a nursing shortage. We need more nurses, so we're going to need more male nurses as well. According to the Arizona College of Nursing, Arizona trends along the national average. Megan Graff, the Assistant Dean of Nursing and Student Affairs for Arizona College of Nursing in Tempe, says the college is seeing more gender diversity among its student population. They also represent things to the patients. Um, so having a male nurse, you know, maybe the male patients might feel a little bit more comfortable. We do have a little over 130 students that are males, and we don't see ourselves any different from anyone else. We're all a team at the end of the day, and uh, giving care to patients has no gender. And giving care to patients is all Medina says that matters. He wants to become a labor delivery nurse and says despite any stigma, he will be successful. Anita Roman, Fox 10 News.